people, including four firefighters, are injured while battling a fast moving fire in Trenton. Eyewitness News reporter Trang Doe is live at the scene with an update from the fire chief. Good morning again, Trang. Hey, good morning, Jim and Rahel. Unfortunately, all five of those people are expected to be okay. Their injuries are non-life threatening. But taking a look here at this home, the fire is finally under control after more than five and a half hours on scene. Right now, firefighters are just wrapping things up. And because this is such a massive response, they're going to be out here for some time, just rolling up hoses and also beginning that investigation into the cause of this fire. Now, take a look at this video that we shot overnight. This fire started around 1 a.m on the 900 block of West State Street. And when firefighters arrived, they found heavy smoke and flames and elevated the fire to two alarms and later three alarms. The homeowner tells us that eight people were home at the time between the building's four apartments. Now, one tenant actually had to be rescued from the second story roof. And Deputy Fire Chief Anthony Moran says four firefighters were hurt. Two of them suffered burns while inside that home looking for anyone who might have been trapped. Again, fortunately, those firefighters are expected to be okay, and all of the tenants did get out. These houses are um, extremely old. The, the wood in there is extremely dry, and some of these houses get chopped up into smaller units to allow for other residents to live in, and it makes it extremely hard to get in there and to get to the seat, seat of the fire. Now, the homeowner tells us that it appeared to him that the fire started inside a wall. Of course, the fire marshal will be looking into that. Meanwhile, this home here is a total loss. But for now, we're live in Trenton, New Jersey. I'm Trango, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Jim Rahel, back to you. All right, Trang, thank you. Thanks.